All right, y'all, we'll get started working on race cars in just a second, but before we do, I wanna tell y'all about the presenting sponsor of today's video, Factor. This October, get Factor and enjoy eating well without the hassle. Simply choose your meals and enjoy fresh, flavor-packed meals delivered to your door, ready in just two minutes, no prep, no mess. Too busy this fall to cook, but wanna make sure you're eating well? With Factor, you can skip the trip to the grocery store, skip the cooking, and skip the cleanup too, but you're still getting the taste and the nutritional quality that you need. Factor's fresh, never frozen meals are ready in just two minutes. All you have to do is heat and enjoy and get back to crushing your goals. Level up with Gourmet Plus options, prepared to perfection by chefs and ready to eat in record time. Treat yourself to upscale meals with premium ingredients like broccoli, leeks, truffle butter, and asparagus. Or for an easy wellness boost, try refreshing beverage options like cold pressed juices, shakes, and smoothies. The thing I like most about Factor is how easy it makes it to eat well. Whether we're here at the shop, on the road racing, or at home, it's so simple to put a meal in the microwave and have it ready in just a couple minutes. And right now, Factor is giving 50% off your first box. All you have to do is head over to factor75.com or click the link below, enter the code HUNTTHEFRONT50 to get 50% off your first box. That's factor75.com, enter the code HUNTTHEFRONT50 for 50% off your first box. Thank you to Factor for being the presenting sponsor of this video. Now let's get to work on race cars. Well, ain't that a sight for sore eyes? All covered in dust and everything. Dragging it out of the weeds. Dragging it out of, well, out of the corner anyway. I don't know. Well, weeds. Not weeds yet. But yeah, we have finally stopped and we have gotten Faithful out of the corner. Gonna get the dust off of it. Ready to go racing, crate racing once again. We are getting ready to go to All Tech Raceway and run the Powell Family Memorial. Wow. <laughs> yeah, it took a beat. Yeah. So, uh, Jesse will be, this is the HTF1 car, old gator bait. Just uh, got her stripped down. Y'all recall we wrecked this one at Talladega a few weeks back. Yeah, and, we uh, did. Yeah, we. Yeah, we wrecked. Yeah. See, I'm, I'm doing you a favor there. It was a team effort. <laughs> it was a team, team effort. effort. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, now it's a team effort getting it back together. That's for sure. Looks like we're unbolting the rear end. Hey, you got a bumper. Yeah, so we've been holding out for like a year and a half on getting a bumper. It's not quite a year. You bent this. Well, you needed one yeah. before then. But uh, I know you yeah. backed into the wall at Deep South when we the were, steering we were shaft came to, off. We trying to, you know, just save a dollar. Mm -hmm. Well, we thought it was going to be a whole lot more expensive than what it was. It was $98. Oh, for the bumper? Yeah. And it bolts together or we got to do some welding? No, you just put the oh. top bar here, top yeah. bottom bar here, and then you link the nice. two bars together. We got a new bumper for Jesse. Y'all can tell that one's seen better days. Which that didn't happen in the wreck. That happened, that happened a while. We've been needing to do that. That happened last year, actually. Big time super late model racing. Yeah. And I guess we're going to pull the rear end out of it? Yeah, I mean, I don't know that it's bent, but it it's just probably bent. On the, like, it's a good chance it is. Tube, stuff right. like that, so... We got a spare. We're gonna go ahead and get that in here and we'll get this one sent to somewhere and make sure it's good. Yeah, going through and yeah. it'll be good to go again. We're not gonna chance it. Nope. So that will be going in Jesse's car today, hopefully today, this week. And uh, we'll be getting both Jesse and Joseph ready for all tech. Like I said, it's the Powell Family Memorial. Where's that check? Right there. Joseph won the Powell Family race last year. It was 27,000, it is 28,000 to win this year at All Tech Raceway this weekend. Uh, gonna be uh, one of the toughest crate late model fields that you will see all year going after the big money, the big win at All Tech. What'd y'all have the hubs off for? To put new shoes in it. Uh -huh. That side when he pulled the axle out, it was all rusty here. Uh -huh. So the water got in there, so he pulled the seal out, and there was no seal. Oh, so now we got a new broken. seal in this one. Hey, you got a new seal in your rear end. Oh, yeah. New bearing. You got all the good stuff. Brand, Brand, new. Brand new bearing, yeah. Brand new seals. Fully serviced. We even scuffed your rotors for you. Mm -hmm. No excuses, Jesse. Not none. Hell, I just want to make the rotors. <laughs> That's a good goal to start with, but once you once you get in the race, then we're planning on you winning it. Somebody 
make sure you check that pinion bolt. This one? Yeah. You know we've had a little one come off before. Yeah, we have. Maybe I need to check it. There's the drive shaft. Might want to inspect it. Better. Pretty solid piece, though. Dang, Jesse! Ow! Are you okay? No. <laughs> you want an impact for that? There you go. All about leverage. All about leverage. You got it. Don't ding our drive shaft with it. Let me take a good look at that. Make sure we don't see any uh, cracks or fractures. Remember when we used to do this without the handles? Yeah, we had it somehow. I feel like we've done it for a while. Yeah, there was a period in time there where we... We had like one rear end for two cars or something. Thankfully, we're not in that situation anymore. Okay. Unless you tear this other rear end up or Joseph tears that one. Then we might be in a bind. Ready? Go ahead. Your way. Your way. Out of it. We were waiting on you to come over here and swipe this rear end up under there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Oh, where, yeah, yeah. where did we last race it run this rear end? Seriously, Jesse, you know? I think was, no this idea. was the one in the 602 car because we swapped that one out for that mm. crate rear end in there because it wasn't a good spare for the super. We've racked our brains and we cannot remember. <laughs> this rear, rear end was under one of these race cars at some point. We just don't remember when or where. It's been in that crash cart since Jordy built it. I know that. Three, two, one. <laughs> Nothing to it. Oh, wait. Jesse needs help. I'm holding everybody up. Okay, it's hanging there. It's like it's twisted. I think so. I'm thinking this point oh, and that yeah. point looks yeah, like it's twisted. Yeah, it does look like it might have. Yeah. Yeah, it's twisted. Mm -hmm. I think it's twisted. Or is that an optical illusion? That's a heim. No, 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 it's not. It's nothing off the heim here. I'm off the base. Yeah, there's another one in there. There is. We'll just put the one. It's got to have that little crook in it. Yeah. You can't have a straight one, so I don't think it is, but. So you are saying it's bent down there. Yeah, that thing dude's laying lay, Yeah, lay it flat. flat. I have to I might take the bolts yeah. out. Put it like that. Just like that. That's what it looks like like this. Huh? Yeah. And put a level on it. It is. Straight edge. Bit. I can see it. Oh. You bent your lift, uh, you, you, you lift arm. Mm. It's got a slight tweak to it. Mm. Dang, Jesse, you run over everything. Can y'all believe the last time we raced this car was May? Yeah. I actually do believe that. Time flies when you're having fun. Like a snail in a slingshot. So was that it? Why not? Yeah. So the last time Joseph ran faithful, why not? Led quite a bit of the race and finished second. I mean, just like you drew it up, we well, we started like sixth or eighth or something. Mm -hmm. Drove to the lead. Drove to the lead. And then this broke. And that broke. So we hadn't, you hadn't even fixed it since then, huh? No. Well, that's what you're working on. Tire rubbed a hole in it and everything. Right. So. Well, that means it was fast the last time you ran it. Yeah. Are you still in your carburetor back? Yeah, I am. <laughs> but Jesse's going to get a brand new one, so. Hey, you get a new carburetor? Yeah, I, I do. <laughs> He's a little salty over losing up. There's, good, there's reason for it. Uh-huh. Just go ahead and know, Joe's been giving me a new carburetor because you know what I mean, so. Hey, news better than you. I've never in my life heard somebody complain more about the new stuff. I'm not complaining. I'm just saying, it's 
It's because, I get it. It's because he likes that one, so he's taking it back, and you get the new one that we ordered. Hey, does this one you don't even know what he likes, so it don't matter. What? Did you win with that one? That one won yeah. this race okay. last year. All right, Here we go. it's starting to look a little bit more like a race car. Last that y'all seen that I think we we're just getting the rear end hung underneath it. Well, we got all that squared away and the four bars, our trailing arms all uh, put back on. And uh, now, oh, and Jordy built a new deck piece. Got the rest of the deck in. Now, as you see, we're missing an important component right here big thanks to Schoenfeld box is upside down big thanks to Schoenfeld getting us a new uh, right side header uh, very quickly because the other one is right here it's actually and it got hit over here it actually bent it some in here so it was got bent too close to the chassis so we have to put a new Schoenfeld header on so in today's video or in the continuation of today's video, Jordan's got to weld up a muffler on the header. You ain't gotta tell them and we put. You gonna let me do this or not? You wanna come over here and video? Hey, do y'all think we need a new spoiler? This is the other thing we're gonna do. The, this actually didn't happen from the wreck. This happened from the wrecker guy. It happened from the wreck. No, it happened from the wrecker guy. Let's just be honest. No. The record truck did this. Well, it wouldn't have happened if you didn't wreck anyway. If you wouldn't have wrecked, then you wouldn't have needed a record, and that wouldn't have happened. Still your fault. <laughs> All right, so Dusty thinks that we can get this thing straight enough to put back on the car. At least try it. Let's see what happens. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. I don't know. Do it, Dusty. Yeah. Do it. Get in there. Oh, that looks oh, much better. Oh, this thing's forward. going back on there. Hey, Dusty. We got to take them rivets out. Oh, who put them there? Who put that down? Okay. All right. And John, right there. Shoot. I think we can go to riveting, Dusty. We can go right on the riveting right here. What do you say? Perfect. Man, Jordan, you look like a welder from way back. Do you, do you, you can you do the head flip? Oh, oh, he means business. Hey, she looks brand new again. Oh, ready to go. Looks sharp. It's, what? it's all cosmetic. All cosmetic. Just bolt on part. <laughs> Mainly cosmetic. Unfortunately, now it's time to rob Jesse of his carburetor. But to be fair, it was Joseph's. It was Joseph's. He lent it to you. We sold mine with the 602 car. Or was it yours or was it mine? We sold the one you were, that me and you were both running. Actually, that one was Joseph's too. <laughs> to be honest with you. Whatever the case, this one's coming off of here. Let me get out of your way, Jordy. And it's going over there on Faithful. Ooh, that's some sticky tape. Been there a minute. Whoa. A lot of horsey torques down there. Oh, that's, I was about to say, what you see down in there? Whoa. Car's, car's rolling, Jordy. Guard moving. He's ready. He's ready to go. He's ready to go. He gets the new regulator and carburetor. Oh, okay. Oh, hey, you got a new regulator too.
Hey, you want to see this? Oh, yeah. What's your new it? piece? Man, new. Smells new. I can smell it from here. Stealth racing carburetor. Oh, man. Oh, there it's ain't just, nothing it's in just it. popcorn. Oh, Dusty says you can eat that stuff. <laughs> Did you think you could do it? No, you can. You can no, eat it. You can eat it. I'll be honest with you. It tastes like you could probably eat it. I mean, you I can. didn't say it was good. <laughs> I, I think it started melting in my mouth. It does. Yeah, right. well. So is this identical to no. the one you got? No. No, it is. Oh, no, This is the latest and greatest. My last year's stuff. You can show me. You hear that, Jesse? Oh really? Yeah. You can show hey. me anything you want, and don't show him that. Show him the number. On if this you uh, if you're faster than him on uh, practice swapping, night, swapping. you're gonna you know you want to swap. Oh, he's already. That's talking. assuming we make it on practice night. Yeah, we got we got a ways to go yet. That's, that's 24 hours from now. We're yeah, we're getting away. there. Or at least we're getting there. Away. Yeah. <laughs> yeah we'll be. Why? Right. What, Jordy? We have more Super Bowls. Than the regular Tampa program. Bay Buccaneers. <laughs> <laughs> I did not. Just not on our crate cars. No, no, I because I, I had to move two Super Bowl carburetors out in the drawer to get one of these. Mm -hmm. so I'm like, dang, there's two, there's two. Hey, we almost got as many as the Cowboys. Yeah. I guess we have reached that point in time that, you know, before we go load them up, we should probably just crank them and make sure they run. What do you say? It's iffy. Especially this one. The last time it was crunk and fired up. Dude, there's gonna be, it's probably gonna throw some smoke out a little bit. You know the dirt dauber's out of it? Stay in there. Dirt dauber. Don't be for long. Okay, let's fire it up then, fellas. Okay. Yeah. Joseph got Joseph's running, sounds good. Now we need to see if this brand new spanking carburetor, how it's gonna run on the old HTF-1. Sounds good. Get some tires on them, get them loaded up. We'll be headed to All Tech Raceway, $28,000 to win. The 10 car with Joseph, the one car with me. And also, thanks again to Factor for being the presenting sponsor of this video. Don't forget to go to factor75.com or click the link below and use the code HUNTTHEFRONT50 for 50% off your first order. Thank y'all for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. We'll see y'all later.